Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to walk through how to deploy a Nest.js application that's using a MySQL database hosted on Avon to Versal. It's a powerful combination, and I'll show you how to get it set up seamlessly. First things first, let's talk about environment variables. You probably have a .env file in your Nest.js project containing your database credentials, right? Well, you should never commit this file directly to your repository for security reasons. You can refer to my video Nest.js config module using env file on my channel to use .env effectively. While Versal often does a great job of auto-detecting Nest.js apps, creating a versal.json file can give you more control. In the root of your project, create a file named versal.json. Here's a basic configuration you might use. Now for the magic. Head over to the Versal dashboard and either import an existing project or create a new one. Connect it to the Git repository where you pushed your Nest.js code. During the configuration step, you'll see a section for environment variables. This is where you'll add the database credentials we talked about earlier, your host, port, username, password, and database name. 